As we explained it earlier, rhythmic harmonics are multiples or divisions of the basic tempo. To establish proportions between these harmonics, we can use numbers. If one represents the basic tempo of a piece of music, 1 16th represents a rhythmic harmonic 16 times slower than the basic tempo. Conversely, compared to 1, 16 represents a rhythmic harmonic going 16 times faster than this basic tempo. In the music search engine, let us open the tab Advanced Music Research Criteria, then Rhythmic Harmonics Distribution, and finally Slowest Rhythmic Harmonic. Let us fix this last parameter, Slowest Rhythmic Harmonic, to a minimum of 5 and a maximum of 6. We obtain a list of 12 results. This is not a surprise, notably because the difference between minimum and maximum is not high. Let us create an account or open the one we created and let us click the buttons playlists and add to the playlist. We can listen to the result, with the help of the YouTube reader or the Spotify reader. Let us notice that, if we do not interrupt the reading. The whole playlist is automatically played until the end of the last title. We can now try to obtain more information about these titles. For instance, in pitch distribution, let us open range of the pitch and, in duration distribution, let us open range of the duration. Let us click on search. Then, let us display the graphics. Let us associate X to slow HR and Y to pitch range. Let us then select the three points which stay in the middle of the displayed points. They correspond to four pieces of music, that we can insert in a new playlist to listen to them, with the help of the corresponding sheet music or not. We can do a similar research for the parameter fastest rhythmic harmonic, and also for any unique rhythmic harmonic, with the parameter presence of individual rhythmic harmonics. Why Music Search Engine analyzes music using musical criteria based on the content of almost 40,000 pieces of music listed in the Why Music database. Today, music listeners listen to more music in a single year than their 17th century ancestors during their entire existence. However, online music services ask their users to have a specific query in mind when entering keywords, such as a title. Due to these language limitations, there is a gap between listeners' expectations and what they receive, in terms of musical content. It is not enough to type the word inspiring to receive as the first search result a piece of music that will automatically inspire us. This is even more obvious in a general search engine. If a user writes, in the search box, what are musical pieces similar to the Ride of Spring by Stravinsky, the results include links to different interpretations of the title, pages devoted to Stravinsky's life or to his work. However, no title similar to the Rite of Spring at the musical level is mentioned directly in the results and no link to listen to this similar music is provided. Everything must still be done. Idem for your favorite music. This means that listeners do not receive an answer to their original question. Neither general search engines, nor streaming services, are programmed either to analyze the musical content of a title and provide the results to the user, or to establish direct musical relationships between different pieces of music. This is not their function, but it is the purpose of why music. We are passionate about our mission, which is to create a technological innovation in the field of music which aims to help all music listeners to understand it in more depth. Developed by a computer engineer recognized for his expertise in the music software industry, why music is more than an algorithm that searches for chords or melodies. It is the first musical search engine in the full sense of the term. In the next video, we will continue to present the why music parameters related to rhythmic harmonics. See you soon on this channel.